you guys how to uh, do the blinker mod as some people call it which is basically getting your blinker to alternate from the front to the side marker when you turn the flasher on uh, not only does this look cool but it's actually better for other drivers when you're changing lanes you can't really see the front turn signals from the side of the car so uh, it's a very easy process I'm just gonna walk you through it so here let's start you only need a few things to do this modification um, you're going to need a, a Phillips screwdriver, a flat screwdriver, some scissors, some electrical tape, some wire, and some wire strippers if you have them. These things make things a lot easier. Okay, the first step is to remove the side marker. Now, removing the side marker is a fairly easy process. Um, in the front, there's a clip, and you're just going to slip the flathead screwdriver behind it and push it in while you pull out the side marker at the same time. Now, be careful because uh, these things tend to break. So, um, yeah, just be careful about this clip and this back clip. And also be careful not to scratch your paint. If you're OCD about your car like I am, now's a good time to clean up behind this side marker because uh, most of the time you're not going to take these off to wash your car. Okay, after that's all cleaned up, when you pull this wire out, or when you pull this light out, you're going to see two wires. You're going to see a red wire and a black wire. To make things easier, you can go ahead and unplug your side marker for now and put that aside so nothing breaks. And now you're going to need to get your scissors. Okay. You're going to want as much of this wire as you can get. So if you need to open the hood and uh, get some more of this wire free, that's probably not a bad idea. On my car, I found that it was uh, easier to do this by pulling the... Um, the blinker wire in back into the engine bay and uh, cutting it here uh, just gives you a lot more room to work with. So uh, basically just cut these two wires, give yourself some space to um, do some, some wire stripping and stuff. Basically you want to cut it like that. Alright, now we're going to prep the plug that you just pulled out. When you uh, pull out your plug, you're going to see a red wire and a black wire. You're going to want to strip them both using your wire stripper. You can use scissors too, uh, it's a little bit more difficult, but um, you can do it that way if you don't have one of these. But I would recommend getting these because they're super useful. Basically this is what it should look like when you're done. Uh, twist the, the tips around so they don't get frayed and stuff. Since we're already down here, um, we're gonna go ahead and, and strip some wires, some of the other wire we got. We're just gonna go ahead and prep that to be connected just so we don't have to do it later. Alright, now that you um, cut up your wires and have them all ready, you can go ahead and take one of the wires you cut and twist it or splice it with the red wire from the original harness. Um, I'm just gonna twist it like this. When you're finished, Doing that, you're going to want to wrap it with some electrical tape or heat shrink, uh, whatever you have. Just like that. Um, this is what you should get when you finish taping it. Uh, nothing really complicated. At this point, you want to you're going to want to go back under the hood. Anyway, basically you're going to want to tape off 
the black wire from the harness coming out of the car and you're going to want to strip the red wire and then from there you're going to take the black wire from the part from the harness that plugs into the blinker and you're going to splice that into the red wire coming out of the car Okay, so now we have our harness back in the front. Um, here's the uh, the wire that I've run connected to the red wire, and you can kind of see, you can't really see, but I've spliced the black wire with the original red wire coming from the car's harness. All right, um, we're almost done here. We just need to do some things here in the front. <laughs> Go ahead and take that out. Make sure you don't lose the screws. And you'll see a harness like this. All right, an easier way to do this, instead of cutting the wires on the car's harness, because there's not that much space, we're just gonna go ahead and modify the wires on the blinker itself. Um, you're gonna need some scissors to take off the, this protective rubber stuff. Uh, let's go ahead and take that off. All right, you'll see three wires in here. You're gonna see a, a black wire, a green wire with a yellow stripe, and a green wire with a blue stripe. The one we're gonna be working with is the green wire with the yellow stripe. Since I have these wire strippers with me, it's gonna make my job a little bit easier. Um, just gonna go ahead and make an area to splice this with. If you don't find, if you don't have any wire strippers, you might find it easier to just um, cut the wire in half and then splice those ends together. Uh, now come, you can see that I made a little cut right there. Now comes the hardest part, I think, of this process, and that's going to be taking this wire and getting it to the front of the car where the original blinker is. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and take this wire um, that we connected to the red wire over there on that harness and we're gonna bring it through where it, the front turn signal goes. Alright. There's our wire. I'm gonna take that and you're gonna connect that to the wire splice you made on the green and yellow wire. Have a nice clean connection like that. Um, and that's pretty much all the wiring we have to do. At this point we can take our modified uh, turn signal, um, we can plug it back in. Plug this wiring in here. And we can go ahead and reinstall this. And you're gonna go ahead and reinstall your side marker too. It's not that hard, you just slide in the front push in the back and it just clips in like that. After you finish wiring it up, um, it's going to look something like this. When the parking lights are off, uh, both blinkers are going to blink um, together. But when you turn on the parking lights, they'll alternate. There you go, it's a pretty simple mod. Um, easy to do, doesn't take much time, and it looks cool. So uh, there you go guys, until uh, we get to you next time. See ya.
chamboche. It wasn't easy. 